It could be a real game changer for people suffering from Parkinson's disease. The Stanford doctors are testing a new treatment that may also have the ability to slow or even reverse some symptoms. As KDU's Ann Rubin reports, a pair of vibrating gloves seems to help not only with tremors, but with speech, walking, and balance. Joan Flack is determined to fight Parkinson's with everything she's got. These 10 years have been tough. You know, it's a challenge and you have to be a fighter. And now, thanks to Stanford Medicine, she'll have a new weapon in her arsenal. These vibrating gloves, yes, gloves, are supposed to counteract many of the worst symptoms of Parkinson's. Tremors, uh, balance gate, all these th smell and taste. We don't have that. We, we, we don't smell anything in Parkinson's. This is supposed to bring all that back to our brains. So yeah, it's a game changer for sure. Dr. Peter Tass has been developing the gloves for decades. This is how they work. They vibrate in a specific pattern, essentially tricking the brain into forgetting its abnormal patterns. The advantage of the glove is that these pathways, these sensory pathways, so to speak, bring the signals, the stimulating signals exactly to the areas and neurons we want to be stimulated. And unlike the current treatment of drugs and brain surgery, the gloves are non-invasive. So far, Stanford's study of them has seen amazing success. Take, for example, this patient, who had trouble walking without a cane. After six months with the glove, he was not only able to walk normally, but he ran his first marathon. Another patient went from issues with his gait to incredible feats at the gym. I think it's just the start, it's just the beginning. You can do a lot by very, very uh, mild type of intervention and you do not need to, to treat invasively. Joan Flack is hopeful the gloves will help her too. She's enrolled in a new clinical trial to test them. Oh my gosh, am I ever. I, I'm convinced it's gonna work. The hope is that the effects of the vibrations are lasting so. even after the gloves come off. By doing this exercise and weaning off the gloves, supposed to just make the change for the rest of my life. That's just a miracle. That is literally a miracle in front of me and, and uh, pretty excited about it. The clinical trial is about to get underway, but they are still enrolling a few more patients. The study is expected to last about 14 months, and they'll be seeking FDA approval after that. In Palo Alto, Ann Rubin, KTVU Fox 2 News.